Did you know all the references in the So So No Friar and Ending music video? First of all, we have a reference from episode 2, where a seed rat came by carrying a seed which fell down and later grew into a blue moonweed flower, a flower from Hemo's hometown. Later, the flower was eaten by a demon. This demon, distinguished by its horns, bears a resemblance to Qual, the demon introduced in episode 3. But since all the demons had horns, there is a chance that this demon could be a demon that Himmel encountered in the past because it ate the flower from Himmel's hometown. Still referring to episode 2, we saw a blue moonweed flower crown that Friarin made for Himmel's statue. If you notice, when Friarin was reminiscing about the past, Himmel was the only one who did not receive the flower crown, and Friarin decided to give Himmel a flower crown as well. Afterward, we had a scene with a flower arranged in a rectangular shape, with a hollow center, resembling a human figure. This could be a reference to Himmel's death in episode 1, as his coffin also filled with flour when displayed at the church. The English translation on this song also state this as a painful memory. And like the 20 years time skip, soon after Himmel was buried, the flower arrangement was later obstructed by a branch with purple leaves, along with a red ribbon. This might seem obvious because there is only one person with purple hair, which is Fern. The red ribbon symbolizes Fern's childhood under Hyder's care. The branch later waved and bloomed into beautiful flowers with butterflies flying beside it. This might be a reference to show that Fern has already grown into a refined lady, and the butterflies might symbolize the hair clip that Friarin bought for her on her birthday. If you recall, the butterfly was also the first magic that Fern learned when she was under Hyder's care. Next up, we had a red flower arrangement that looks like a hair. This is most likely a reference to Stark because his hair is also red colored. In episode 5, he made his first debut as a warrior that was able to fend off a solar dragon and Aizen asked Friarin to recruit him. Later on, we saw a collection of orange flowers tied into a long braid. This is a reference to the fourth episode, where Flam had a similar hair color and hairstyle. When Friarin remembers her past, her master, the legendary mage, Flam, was planting a tree to protect the forest. Later, the long braid orange flower withers, symbolizing Flam's death but on the other side the tree still grows. While the rest of the ending music video doesn't seem to have any particular meaning, we could see Friar and silhouette behind the abstract imagery. After continuing to watch the rest of the ending music video, there are red birds flew by, and it might be a reference to events in much later episodes. I'll stop here to avoid major spoilers, because the bird plays a significant role in those episodes. If you want to learn more about So So No Friarin, please like and subscribe. See you in the next episode.